Hey, Summit, this is Edward. You know that's got Jake. This is your weekly update coming at you live right here. We've not done a live one in two weeks. No, we haven't. Because we, we pre-recorded last week's two weeks ago, so it's good to be back live and in action. And Actually, they're all kind of pre-recorded because, I mean, if it was live, we would be like on Facebook Live right now. Okay, we should but do that one Thursday. Do a Facebook Live? Yep. See if we can get everybody in touch. <laughs> I'll just do it at night, though, because people at work don't get on Facebook. Cause that's well, that you save them. You run it live and then you save them. Because nobody gets on their Facebook yeah. at work, Jake. Nobody. All right. All right. Hey, so we've got a couple of things coming up uh, this week and this month. One is this Sunday. It's huge. Uh, we're going to be making our proposed budget for, for 2022 available at the guest and information desk. Uh, you can pick up that packet starting this Sunday, and uh, we'll also have that online for you to look at. Uh, and, and you can download that from our website. And so we want you to review that and look at that. If you have any questions uh, on that, our elders and uh, contact are there on that last page. Uh, you can contact one of those guys or one of us. We're elders as well and get your questions answered. And then on the 12th, that's a week from Sunday, we will be voting on that budget. Uh, our elders will be available before the service and after the service at the guest and information uh, desk there. If you have any questions, you can ask them on that day as well. So uh, make sure that you pick that up this week. You get a copy of that. You can come by during the week uh, and grab one from the office as well. But that's kind of our where we're going for this next year and what we feel like God has put on our hearts as elders and uh, ministry team to do ministry in our community for next year. And so make sure you grab one of those. Uh, we're going to vote on that. I'm kind of excited about that, Jake. Uh, God's been so faithful to us through the years uh, to meet our budgets. And you guys are on target to meet our budget this year as well and continue to do ministry in this area so make sure you pick that up this week also i don't know if you know jake uh, my kids came home last night from youth with disciple now registration uh it's going to be january the 14th through the 17th uh so if you have a student between sixth and 12th grade you can get your kids signed up right now david was saying uh tuesday staff meeting he needs some kids uh signed up and i know it's the holidays i know you guys are thinking about uh santa claus and uh christmas i know that's all you're thinking about uh I, live, I watched Christmas Vacation last night when I got home from youth I ministry. Saw I saw that. Uh, so make sure you get your kids signed up. It's going to be a life-changing weekend, I promise you. Uh, so many decisions are made at Disciple Now. Uh, the kids will be at home this year. We've got uh, Michael John Clements coming in, our buddy. He's, uh, man, he's the best. Unbelievable. Uh, Eddie is going to be here speaking. Looking forward to meeting him. and. Uh, your kids, it's going to change your life, I'm telling you. So make sure you get uh, signed up. Hey, did we get all the um, uh, angel, trees. angel trees? Yeah. Hey, those are due Sunday. I need you to bring them back Sunday. I've got to deliver those Monday down to Helping Hands. Uh, we also have some needs that are starting to come across. I'll be making some phone calls. A lot of people that didn't, weren't able to pick up angel trees said they'd be willing to help families out. And so I did get something come across my desk late, late, late yesterday. Um, and so if you're interested in helping out, stop by the info desk, see me there before or after the service. And then at 1130, if ever doesn't go too long in his message, uh, we're going to have a groups gathering this uh, Sunday. <laughs> Look, many of you are filling out communication cards and you're checking that you have interest in groups. I have contacted you. I've talked to some of you. Some of you have left messages. I've emailed this is an opportunity for you to come yep. and meet other people that are interested in forming a small group and also meet some of our new small group leaders. So come and hang out with us. It's not long, 30 to 45 minutes. We get to know each other. We talk about what groups is, the mission of groups, and we get to know each other. It's a really relaxed uh, atmosphere, really relaxed time. We'd love to have you. And so you're, you're going to give away free gift cards, too, for everybody that shows up to that go eat afterwards. Is that right? What else we got? <laughs> hey, back to the angel tree thing. I, these other needs that are coming through is a great thing. I know I've talked to some of you guys this week uh, that watch this. In fact, I was talking to somebody last night. And uh, they came by to get an angel tree, and they were already all gone. Yeah. And so they were asking, you know, hey, what do we do now? We have an event that our worship pastor and his wife have been a part of. They helped kind of start in East Texas. It's called Clear the Tree Event. 
It's going to be a week from Saturday. Uh, it's a, an event that happens in Longview. They lead worship. It's at the Longview Mall. It's really a cool deal. I've never heard of it until Andrew kind of came and shared that with us. And he uh, wanted us to invite you guys. If you have uh, next Saturday off, that's a week from Saturday, uh, and you want to be a part of that event over in Longview, it's, it, it, it reaches people all over East Texas, including our area. Uh, they basically go into the mall, they do worship, they send people out, they collect resources, and they, they fulfill Christmas for people yeah. right there on the, at that event. So uh, if you want to be a part of that, connect with Andrew, Andrew at SummitHeightsFellowship.com, Andrew at SummitHeightsFellowship.com. Uh, reach out to him if you have questions about that. I know we still have needs. That's another way you can participate. So. Hey, another thing on our needs, somebody, and I, I would invite anybody to do this, even if you're one of the people that signed up and said, I'd be willing to help a family. Uh, I had somebody that came in yesterday. Don't even wait. I mean, don't wait for me. Don't wait for a knee. We had somebody that came in yesterday and said, hey, here's a, here's a gift card to Walmart. I know you're going to cool. get a phone call. If a mom needs to go buy something for Christmas, give her this give her this gift card. So if you just want to pick up a gift card, 25, 50, 100 bucks, and drop that off at the at the church, I will get that in the hands of families that need help for Christmas. Yeah. And, and, and there's gonna be a lot. I mean, there's yeah. no doubt. And, and and Summit, thank you for being so generous. I mean, you guys took those angel trees like that Sunday, right? Oh I mean, man, it was like it was like me at Thanksgiving lunch. <laughs> Just, I mean, that's what it was like, man. It was like they was eating them up, getting them all, and all this stuff. That's awesome. That's awesome. Hey, uh, Christmas Eve, December the 24th, we're going to... Will it be the same time as last year, December 24th? 5 o'clock. We didn't have it last year, remember? Oh, I didn't know if Christmas changed. No, it comes the like same Easter. time every year, oh. you know, like that. So December 24th, we're going to do a night of worship, and we're bringing that back. We didn't get to do that last year because of Putting COVID. the band back together. Uh, and, and it's going to be awesome. Andrew is putting in a ton of work with his team to lead us in worship that night with candlelight and all that good stuff as we celebrate. Uh, it'll be about 45 minutes to an hour long, and so you can come and worship at 5 o'clock on Christmas Eve, and then you can get back home to your uh, families and all that good stuff. Uh, it, it's going to yeah. be a cool deal. Now, Children's Ministry has something going on next Wednesday. Is that right? They have something going on every Wednesday. No, but it's the whole group yeah, coming you, in yeah, this so, next Wednesday. Yeah, so, but contact Ashley. She's got a lot of stuff happening there for them. And uh, Ashley, SummitHeightsFellowship.com. Or, or if you're not getting her uh, weekly email uh, yeah. about what's going on in children's ministry, make sure you reach out to her and get signed up for that because that'll give you all the information that's going on. And I think next Wednesday night, it's going to be it's going to be killer, dude. I, th I think they're all wearing their Christmas pajamas, and uh, it's going to be a cool deal. So, hey, Summit, we love you. You got anything else this morning? Today? Hey, we love you. Can't wait to see you Sunday. We're going to be jumping back into our worship series uh, starting this Sunday. So make sure you're here. Bring somebody with you. If you're joining us online, invite someone to join with you. Do a watch party. Uh, we, we love it that you join us online with our online church and uh, in person. So make sure you're here this Sunday, 10 a.m., ready to worship. We love you. Have a great weekend. We'll see you Sunday morning.